आई पी एन कोड फैकल्टी कॉमर्स एंड मैनेजमेंट पी एन ई ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ पी एन ई ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस टूडे आई डिलीवर लेक्चर ऑन कंसाइनमेंट जनरली सेल्स इज टू बी डिवाइडेड इन टू टू पार्ट डायरेक्ट सेल्स एंड इनडायरेक्ट सेल्स If any sales made by trader, that is direct sales, and if any sales made through agent, that is indirect sales. For find out profit on direct portion, trader make trading account, and find out profit for indirect segment, trader make consignment account. Finally, profit of consignment account and trading account transfer to the entire account to find out overall profit or loss of a business. In case of consignment, two parties are come into existence: consigner and consignee. Consigner, person who deliver the goods, and consignee, who deliver the goods for the purpose of sales. For that, consignor pay consignee three types of commission: number one, normal commission; second, day grade commission; and third, overriding commission. Out of three commission. normal commission is unconditional and remaining two commission is conditional normal commission any sale made by consignee straight forward consigner pay consignee and commission that is normal commission second is day grade commission generally liability of the debts is consigner but in case of if liability is to be bear by consignee then consignor pay consignee additional commission that is day grade commission after providing day grade commission liability of bad debts is to be bear by consignee overriding commission also a conditional commission uh, at the time of delivering goods consignor caught a price to consignee at which goods is to be sale by consignee if any sale made by consignee more than invoice price then consignor pay consignee excess over invoice price that is overriding commission for find out profit or loss on consignment consignor prepare consignment account in case of consignment all expenses is to be recorded in the debit side of consignment account and income and closing stock is to be recorded in credit side of consignment account maximum in case of consignment three types of cost come into existence number 1 that is purchase cost for purchase cost entry is to be made consignment account debit to goods and on consignment for consignor expenses consignment account debit to cash and for consignee expenses consignment account debit to consignee and another expenses are consignor pay consignee commission for that consignment account debit to consignee and here for sale made by consignee entry is consignee account debit to consignment in consignment by consignee and stock remain with consignee that stock with consignee for detail please visit our website www.grokbo.com